including that rushing touchdown, which is the only one of the game. Three games in the NBA on Thursday night. Clippers steamrolled in Golden State, 141-122. Seven Clippers scored in double figures. Seven Bucks scored in double figures as Milwaukee won at Houston, 117-111. And Atlanta, 117-100 win as they open their season at Detroit. I'm Ralph Urban. I never give me a, a spot in there to get out. But I digress. Good morning on a With Lacucci Friday. X's and O's show, Fox Sports Radio, Valdosta, 11.50 a.m. and 94.3 FM. We're broadcasting to you live. 23.25 U.S. Highway 84 East. I get to be your host. Spencer Van Horn, good morning and thank you for making us part of your day. You can listen to us worldwide on the Wide World Web, foxsportsvaldosta.com or the TuneIn app. And uh, you can dial us up and join the conversation at any time, 229-302-4442. We're going to welcome in here at the 8 o'clock hour our friend Gretchen Quarterman. Uh, Gretchen, you've you've been good friends with Scott James for uh, quite some time, have you not? Oh, indeed. Yeah. Indeed. Thanks for having me this morning. Yes, ma'am. We're, we're we're happy to uh, to to have you on. Now you've got, and I've got it right with Lacucci. With Lacucci. I don't know why I didn't have it right the first time. My brain does a. Uh, my stepmother calls them brain farts from time to time, so I think that's what happened there. It, it has a lot of letters, but you say them all. <laughs> Absolutely. Walls boomerang, and this is the second annual. Um, usually when people come in and they're promoting races, it's 5Ks and 3Ks or, you know, whatever else, a 10K but from time to time. People want to run on foot, but uh, you're going to race in boats. We are racing in boats, and you can either bring your own boat or we'll have uh, boats available for free from uh, No Worries Expeditions and VSU Corps. And they'll have uh, single kayaks, tandem kayaks, and canoes, so you can bring a partner if you want. Um, and we'll race down the river and then turn around and race back up. Now lots of times when they have a race, they race up the river and then they come back down because it's a little easier, you have the current behind you. But with the flow as little as it is, and to make the race a little harder, we're racing down first and then back up. Very good, so hence the name Boomerang. Then. Boomerang, that's correct, you go down and come back. Very and, good. And it makes it really great because you don't have to worry about where's my car gonna be, how will I get my boat out at the end if I'm racing. Um, we start and end at the same place. And we'll have um, some vendors there. The Boy Scouts will be there with some information. We'll have uh, hot dogs available from the uh, hot dog guy. Let's see. No, I want to make sure I have his name right. Um, we'll just call him the hot dog guy. The hot dog guy. <laughs> TNT hot dogs. <laughs> TNT hot dogs. He has delicious sausages. He, he has a uh, food truck. Very good. And um, like I said, VSU Corps will have uh, boats available and, and No Worries Expeditions. Also, um, uh, the first some number of registrants, I'm not positive, uh, but if you get in the first group of registrants, we are calling this Paddle in a Pint. You'll get a beer from the Georgia Beer Company, a coupon to carry down to the brewery and uh, collect for free. That's part of your registration. Um, one per paid registration, so if you're tandem, um, if you have two in your boat, you're only getting one beer. Sorry. <laughs> uh, Gotta share. <laughs> <laughs> you have to share. And and the beers will not be at the race, they'll be at the brewery. So yeah, you no can, paddling and drinking. No at the paddling same time. and drinking. You will go down there and, and meet our friends at the brewery. They have been a wonderful sponsor. You know, the Wells Watershed Coalition advocates on behalf of the rivers in the Swanee Basin. So that includes the with Lacucci, our friend, yeah. um, to make sure the water stays boatable, swimmable, fishable and to hold polluters accountable. Because yeah. when we go down to the river to boat or swim, we want to know that it's safe to get in the river. Yeah, absolutely. Now this is the second year. What kind of helped get this started? Give us some of the background of, well, for the Walls Boomerang. Well, we have a spring race, um, uh, the Big Little River Paddle Race on the Little River um, up uh, in uh, Adel. 
And one of our members, uh, Bobby McKenzie, who's uh, an airman, said um, he'd like to have something different. And um, so he organized this race last year. And our paddlers, uh, the youngest one last year, I think, was seven. Mm -hmm. Our oldest one last year was our winner. He was 68. So we have people who are in our community who are very fit. And not everybody runs. This is if you have bad legs and you you're not running, you have bad knees. This is a sport for you. Sure, sure. Um, we also have an outing every month where we go paddling somewhere on the rivers, and we have coming up on the full moon. We paddle every full moon at Banks Lake, and if you have not been out there with the sun setting and the moon rising, you need to come along. It's really fun. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So Walls Boomerang. This is going to start up tomorrow down on the Withlacoochee River and uh, 11 a.m. Now we can sign up day of, correct? You can sign up the day of. Um, the race itself starts at 11, so arrive early-ish so that you can get your boat down there and be in the water at 11 because that's when the race starts at 11. Um, you can buy your tickets online. Um, if you go to our Facebook event, you can get your ticket through Eventbrite until 5 o'clock tonight. And then if you didn't get your ticket tonight, you can get your ticket tomorrow at the event. But remember, the sooner you sign up, the better chance you have of getting one of those tickets that has a beer with it. Absolutely. <laughs> paddle in a pint. <laughs> yeah, paddle in a pint. Uh, perfect. So a uh, great opportunity to, uh, to come out and do some supporting, uh, get into the boats, get on the river, have a nice morning. Obviously, it's, uh, it's always nice in this area uh, this time of year on, on the water. It's perfect at this time of the year. It won't be too hot tomorrow. Um, that's why we do our races spring and fall. Water isn't necessarily the fullest in the river, but there's plenty of water to be able to race. Fantastic. And if you have any questions, you can uh, contact Bobby McKenzie. His uh, phone number is 808-445-4503. And if you have any questions or you want to say, I want to reserve one of those boats from VSU Corps or uh, No Worries Expeditions, let him know so that they'll have the boat out for you when you get there. And that number is 808 808- Four four five four five zero three. That's correct. Fantastic. So if you want to get in, talk, in touch with uh, these folks and get involved, please uh, feel free to get in touch with uh, Bobby McKenzie again. 808-445-4503. Gretchen, uh, anything else you want to add about coming out for the for the boomerang tomorrow? Well, come on, it's going to be a beautiful day. Um, it's it's a race if you want or a leisurely paddle. There's a ton of categories, so not not just to you know the first place winner is going to win something. We have some beautiful um, uh, mugs uh, like a yeti, but not um, that our boomerang uh, logo on it. And um, come win a prize, get a beer, uh, enjoy being outside, meet some other people who are interested in. Uh, Watershed Conservation. Fantastic. Gretchen, thanks so much for the time this morning, and we look forward to, uh, to coming on out for the, for the boomerang tomorrow morning. X's and O's show. We're Fox Sports Radio about Austin, 1150 AM. Quick break, and we'll do the uh, second part of our interview with Coach Shermer and Caleb O'Neill from women's basketball. X's and O's show, Fox Sports Radio. Gretchen, thank you so much. Thanks. I'm going to go let Chuck in. Yeah, I've got a million for having me. Yeah. That's my fault.